Hey guys, it's Victoria and welcome to today's video. So this one is going to be my what's on my iPad. If you haven't already, go check out my unboxing my iPad video. Um, it's in one of these corners. I never remember which one it is. But here is my iPad. It is the newest iPad Pro um, 11 inch. I think it's only like 128 gigabytes. I also have a video where I unboxed the Apple Pencil and Magic Keyboard. I will also link that as well. So yeah, this is the Magic Keyboard. It is the third one, the most recent one, and the Apple Pencil 2. The grip that I have on it is just from Amazon. Um, I will link that down below as well. We're also doing this video from the couch today because it's comfy, it's fun. It's a little, we're having a little comfy day. Um, just doing a lot of laundry. Um, we're in my new Katherine Manning merch. It says do it for you because we do it for us. But yeah, so here is the iPad. I'm gonna take it out of this case. It's just a space gray iPad Pro. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys everything I've got on here. I've got a lot of stuff. Stuff for school, stuff like I've got games. I've got a bunch of stuff. So I'm gonna um, screen record. I'm gonna do it basically the same way that I would with um my what's on my iphone videos okay so this um screensaver is made by julia k christ um i will link it down below as well and yeah so i just have two pages and usually it's on its side so it usually oh maybe it's not gonna let me rotate it because i'm recording but usually it's on its side so it looks a little bit different chrome dino game oh okay anyway um and then calendar, clock, photos, camera, and then I have a folder that I'll get to in a minute. Um, I have the same to-do list um, that's on my phone on here, and then I also have a FamCal um, with all of my friends and everything so that, because we're always trying to like plan times to hang out, but we're always busy so we made a calendar with all of us in it so we can figure it out then the productivity folder is basically just all the apps that come on um the ipad that i just didn't want sitting out and in the bottom here i have messages chrome gmail and good notes good notes is where i take all of my notes this is my um bio notes as of right now if you guys want a video on how i take my notes i would be more than happy to do that um i just don't know if that's something you guys would want to see but yeah and then i also have a digital planner on here too oh i haven't planned for this week yet so that's down here and then obviously i've got like my most recently used and then i have this widget um that i made on color widgets and they've got a bunch of different options. Um, so this is the one that I have, this pastel one. Um, and then I have four folders, entertainment, school, other, and games. So in entertainment, I have Hulu, Netflix, Snapchat, um, YouTube, YouTube TV, Pinterest, Amazon, and Facebook. The usual so I can watch shows. Scroll through Pinterest, scroll through Facebook. Um, school is my most used um, folder. I've got Pearson, which is how I access my like e-textbooks. Quizlet. Y'all know about Quizlet. I love Quizlet. Um, I've got Pulse, which lets me access um, my online stuff through an app. Um, Outlook, which we use for... It's my school email. Um, Zoom, Microsoft Word. I'm in the middle of an essay right now. Um, Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Slides. Um, lockdown Browser. I don't know if you guys have had to use the Lockdown Browser before, but when you do it on an iPad, it just has an app. And then Google Calendar, which I use to plan literally anything and everything. Um, yeah. Um, and then my Microsoft OneDrive, which I also use for school. My other app has Widgetsmith and Color Widgets, which I already showed you Color Widgets. You know what Widgetsmith is. Um, Notion, which I use quite a bit. Um, Skyline and I are moving into a house, so I've been kind of planning 
stuff. Um, I have a content calendar on here. And yeah, this is just um, a layout that I got from somebody else. I don't even remember where I got it at this point. Um, but if I can find it, I'll link it below. And then I've got Fonto, which you just use for text and fonts and stuff. Studio, which I use. Um, that one I use for, like, text on my GoodNotes and stuff. Um, I'll show you more of that if I do a video on how I take my notes. Um, then I have FamCal, which I already showed you from that widget. Um... And then iFont, which lets me download, um, it lets me download fonts into GoodNotes. Um, so I'll also show you more of that if I do a notes video. And then I have games, which I have a lot of because I work the night shift right now. Um, so I've got a bunch of games to keep me entertained. I've got Super Salon. I don't think I've even ever played this. But it's the one that you always see on the ads. Um, yeah, I haven't even played it. But it's the one you always see on the ads where you get them like makeovers and stuff. Then I've got Episode, Nonogram, which I am like addicted to this game. It's just, it's it's this one that you always see, you know. You know. Um, sketchbook, which it's just, you know. It's like Procreate, but free. And then... I have Design Home, exactly what it sounds like, you decorate houses, Dream House, which actually is not fun, um, Wordscapes, I'm sure you've seen ads for this one, but, you know, um, Zen Match, um, usually I get all of these from, like, ads, I just download them from ads, um, this one is what it looks like. Um, and then Chris, which I've actually been really entertained by, so, um, it's like a crossword. It's like, this one's pomegranate, but I don't have the letters for it. And then, obviously, your app library, which all of my apps are on my screen, so there's nothing in there to show. But, yeah, that is everything that is on my iPad. Um, this video, I hope it wasn't boring. Um, I just thought that I would show that because I know my what's on my iPhone videos usually do pretty well. Because um, I know people like to watch those. So, I figured I'd go ahead and film this one for you guys. I do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Because we are getting pretty close to 1,000 subscribers and I would really love to reach that. I think it'd be really cool. I never thought I would be where I am today. So I've got you guys to thank for that. When I started this channel, I didn't think it even hit 100 subscribers. And here we are, almost to 1,000. But anyway, yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in my next one. Bye!